How's it going guys? So today I'm going to be comparing the new Uncharted 4 gameplay that we received yesterday along with the official trailer that we received back at E3. But if you guys still want me to cover this game and are excited for it, let me know by dropping a like below. That is always really appreciated. I love you guys even more and if you don't then simply go ahead and leave a dislike and as well leave a comment in the comment section below. And without further ado, let's continue into today's Uncharted 4 video. So yesterday Sony released a new gameplay trailer for Uncharted 4 at the PlayStation Experience event. Now back in E3, Naughty Dog did claim that his trailer ran on a PS4 in real time 1080p and 60 frames per second. So with that said of course it is going to look absolutely amazing. Now for starters, let's just compare the E3 model with the yesterday's PlayStation Experience one. Now the biggest difference here is actually his hair. Now as we can clearly see, the PlayStation Experience model which is on the right has less detailed hair than the one on the left which was taken from the E3 trailer. And you can actually notice this more if you just simply take a look at the edges. Now so far it does seem that the E3 trailer visuals seem to have a higher quality than the actual in-game ones and a big difference between the E3 trailer and the latest in-game footage for example is the complete absence of light shafts. Now even in this scene in which we should be getting some shafts from that hole there aren't any and in contrast the E3 reveal trailer features some pretty realistic shafts caused by the moonlight and it did look pretty insane but in the gameplay video even when Drake is fighting in daytime there there are no light shafts whatsoever. Now moving on to the shadows, in the E3 reveal trailer, Drake's model was cast in some again realistic highly detailed cell shadows, but unfortunately the latest gameplay trailer lacked in them. Now while there are some kinda ambient occlusion effects, it seems that a lot of light sources do not cast shadows. And furthermore, the lighting system itself seems pretty simple than the one used in the E3 trailer. And the shadowing system just feels so basic and plain as all cell shadows are pixel wide due to their lower quality nature. Now as we can see here there is an actual light source behind Drake and as a result of that we do get a pretty nice shadow on the ground. However if you guys notice the complete lack of cell shadows and just how empty and flat Drake does look himself. Now of course not everybody is going to agree with this but however there is no doubt that the whole lighting and shadowing system seems to have already been downgraded quite a lot. Now last but not least, the E3 reveal trailer did pack in some pretty realistic water drops that are missing from yesterday's gameplay video. And instead of those highly detailed water drops, we get some simple water splashes. So all in all, it's pretty obvious that the in-game footage is not up to what Naughty Dog showcased in the E3 reveal trailer. But all this doesn't mean that the game looks awful overall because in my opinion Uncharted 4 without a doubt is still the most impressive visually but it just doesn't really seem that it's completely finished because even yesterday some glitches were happening during a live demo so yeah that does say quite a lot. But I'm still really excited for this game because the story definitely does look really promising. But guys, with that said, that does unfortunately bring today's video to an end. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up, that is always really appreciated. I love you guys even more and if you guys are new around here, then please go ahead and hit that subscribe button below. If you would like to stay up to date with more open world game news, such as Just Cause 3 and a ton more, again, that would be really, really appreciated and I love you guys even more. And with that said, I'll catch you guys in the next video. But until then, as always, I hope you guys are having yourselves a super awesome day and stay awesome, stay beautiful and adios amigos.